so I love this scene. This to me feels like how an explosive decompression would go down as far as I understand. Mm. Suddenly, quickly, and death quickly. Poof. Don't finish your sentence. There is a moment. <laughs> Gases are powerful. Right. There's, there's, yeah. So it's, there was some, we did this in a seminar. It was like calculation of like the latent energy in the gas. And people were like, oh, it's nothing. It's just gas. But it's like, like compare that to dropping a bowling ball. People are like, the bowling ball is so heavy. It was going to hit the ground so hard. But if you think about the energy inside of the gas, there's pressure and there's temperature. And so there's actually like enormous amounts of energy. Right. And so if you consider the pressure from inside of one atmosphere to the pressure outside space, so zero, like that's a huge amount of force just, just, just ready to pop. Right. And you give it some outlet, energy. some crack, some fault, and it just finds rapidly just out. rips stuff apart. Yeah. There's, there's an enormous amount of energy in it. Yeah. And it's relentless. It just, won't it, stop it's, it's non-linear you can't even walk yeah. it back it it, right. it it cracks it's gone right and it just rips it it causes a cascade that rips apart this pretty strong spacecraft mm -hmm. it's just mm -hmm. incredibly powerful don't fuck with gases uh, yeah you get you get some amount of oxygen because humans need oxygen to breathe and then when you just start ripping apart circuits there's going to be a short amount of time where that circuit is in the breakdown voltage, where it's broken, but it's close enough for an arc to happen. If you get that arc with an oxygenated environment, then psh, explosion, mm -hmm. like actual explosion, not just ripping stuff apart, but like combustion right. explosion. Right. <sighs> Terrifying. Terrifying. I think this is a sign that man is like lost it. Like he's, he's, right. he like. First of all, he's saying things about like survival and like, like mm -hmm. yo, man, like, what, like, yeah. what are you doing here? Like we're trying to set up a colony. And, and then he and does this weird thing about like he lies to people so that he can escape by himself. Like what? what like get get Dr. Brand and Romilly at this point. Get them on your on board with you. Like I get it. I get it that that Cooper like wants to go home. OK, you can't work with him. Right. But like the other two, like they're still on the mission. That's right. Why did he abandon? Why did he lie? Why did he not try to work as a team, even though he was weak? Also, he, does he forget how gases and airlocks work? Like he's completely lost it. That's right. Right. He's NASA trained, and so he should yeah. know docking procedures. And he like ignores it; it just blows past. Right. And to be so careless with an airlock seal, I mean, mm -hmm. that's a basics no no. That's that's your lifeline. Right. Can't, you need the atmosphere to breathe. Yeah. So he's it's just he's just completely lost it. No good. Mm -hmm. Oh man, 